Greetings, fellow action figure connoisseurs, and welcome back to another episode of Digital Caveman Presents. I, as always, am your host, the Digital Caveman, and today I will be presenting you with the Marvel Legends Hasbro Pulse exclusive Hellfire Club Guard. Thanks for watching my videos. If you like what you see, please comment below, like, share, subscribe, don't forget to ding the bell so that in the future you will be notified of future content drops. And with all that said, let's get into it. Now as always, first up, let's take a look at the packaging, such as it is. Marvel Legends series, nice artwork of the Hellfire Goon himself, or Hellfire Guard. Hellfire Club symbol, Hellfire Club Guard. Warning! Don't stick things in your pie hole. Hasbro. Artwork carries over onto the side. Marvel Legends series. Pulse. Hasbro. Same thing on the other side, except the artwork that carries over is a bit different. On the back, all kinds of small print and legalese and symbols I don't know, and a barcode, and a Hasbro, and an attention... And then on the bottom, not for under three, small parts, yada, yada, yada. And let's open it up real quick and take a look at how he comes packaged on the inside. He comes in a baggie with a rifle and a pistol. Kind of like the old school Mellaway figures, except the box was a plain white mailer, usually. All right. That covers it for the packaging. And before we take a look at the figure, let's take a look at his two accessories. Not a new mold, I don't think. I think we've seen this gun several times before. And I think we've seen this rifle also. I think it comes with the Hydra Trooper. Hasbro Army Builder. In fact, I think the pistol comes with that one also. There he is. Nice looking laser rifle thing. Alright, now let's take a look at the figure himself with his creepy little face. You can see his eyes in there. Staring at your soul. And the little butt split down the middle of his face. Uh, the red paint here. The belt is glued, well, maybe it's not glued on. But anyway, he has a belt, it's a separate piece. Alright, articulation wise, his head spins all the way around. I bump the camera again. He can look up that far. He can look down that far. On his arm, all the way around. And up that far. Swivel at the bicep. Double jointed elbow. Can go up that far. And at the wrist. All the way around and in and out. And yeah, in and out on this hand too. Rotation at the waist. Oh, let's not forget the ab crunch. That far down. That far back. So pretty good. Kick up that far back 
that far because his butt gets in the way. Upper thigh cut or we'll swivel all the way around. Double jointed knee goes up that far. There's a cut here where it swivels all the way around at the shin. Ankle goes down that far. Goes up that far. And of course, forward facing pin for rocker. And I bumped the camera again. I stopped doing that. All right. That does it for the figure. And now it is time for comparisons. And with me, as always, is Titans Returns Legends Class Bumblebee. G.I. Joe Classified Cobra Infantry. These guys are both goons, so they hang out together at a bar sometimes. I would think, anyway. And he's falling down on the job. And this is how he compares with Star Wars Black Series Elite Clone Trooper. Again, these guys might drink together. Even though he's a little taller than the clone. So, they scale up okay, not great. Silver Centurion Iron Man. And Wolverine in the blue and yellow. Wolverine is a bit shorter than he is, and that's fine because we all know that Wolverine is a short, short dude, but not as short as Puck from Alpha Flight. And I don't know if you guys are tired of seeing this guy or not, but let me know in the comments. Here he is. The old Toy Biz Lord of the Rings Sauron. Not to be confused with Sauron. And as far as the weapons go, he can hold them. Maybe. If I can get it in his hand. There. Holds the rifle just fine. And there we go. Now he's dual wielding. Holds a pistol just fine. And now for my final thoughts on the Hasbro Pulse exclusive Hellfire Club Guard. Uh, he's pretty plain, minimal paint applications, uh, reissues of weapons that we've seen before. But that's what we expected to get out of the little box and a baggie. If you are a troop builder, you will love this figure. If you're not, one will do you. Especially if you got that Hasbro Pulse exclusive Hellfire Club Inner Circle pack. You may want more than one of these guys. Thanks for watching my video. If you liked what you saw, or even if you didn't, I guess, please comment below. Like, share, subscribe. Don't forget to ding the bell.
so that when I drop content in the future, you will be notified. And with all that said, I'll see you next time.